More than 24 hours after Hurricane Barrel made landfall, over 2 million people in the greater Houston area spanning from the coast to the northern parts of the city and into Montgomery County remain without power. It's Tuesday, July 9th, Houston. Hello again, everybody. This is Mike Acosta with News and Matters to You on the Houston City Beat Update brought to you by Funding State. As of this morning, Centerpoint reports 1.8 million customers remain without power, while Entergy and Texas New Mexico report an additional 232,000 and 92,000 outages in the northern region and south of Houston, respectively. Centerpoint aims to restore power to an additional 1 million customers by Wednesday as crews continue to assess the damage to power lines across the area. Notably, over 800,000 customers had their power restored on Monday. To assist those still without air conditioning, cooling centers throughout the Houston area will be open today as the region expects sunny skies and highs in the low 90s. We will have a list of locations on all of our Houston City Beat social channels. At least six people have died in the Houston area due to Hurricane Barrel. Five of the fatalities were caused by fallen trees, and one was a civilian employee of the Houston Police Department who drowned while attempting to commute to work. Cleanup efforts are underway throughout the city to remove fallen trees and other debris left in the aftermath of the storm. Hurricane Barrel has now weakened to a tropical depression as it moved into Arkansas. Isolated showers are still possible today due to lingering tropical moisture. Floodwaters will continue to flow into waterways, potentially causing some street flooding. However, conditions are expected to gradually improve throughout Tuesday. NRG Stadium's roof suffered visible damage to its fabric portion. A large hole could be seen in one of the retractable roof panels. Officials are assessing the damage before releasing a statement. This is not the first time the stadium's roof has been damaged. In 2008, Hurricane Ike caused extensive damage, turned off several sections of the retractable roof's fabric. The Astrodome, although currently not in use, appeared unscathed next door to NRG Stadium. Looking ahead to the rest of today and the week, the Houston area can expect a dry forecast with scorching highs in the lower 90s. Stay with us for more updates. This has been your Houston City Beat update with news to matters to you, brought to you by Funding State. Get the capital advantage for your business. Visit fundingstate.com. For Houston City Beat, I'm Mike Acosta.